I feel like I haven't done one of these in such a long time. The last one that I did was my LA one, but that felt so different. That just felt like a whole holiday vlog in itself. This one is like a full usual Susie Lola outfits of the week. Today's Wednesday and we're going to a pop-up event with my friends Abby and Jemima. We're also gonna go out for dinner after. But I've had a bit of a mare as I had this whole outfit planned around the jacket I'll be wearing tonight, which is by Damps and Madder. And originally I thought, oh, I'm just gonna go for an entire green look through this like long top short dress I'm wearing that's from Fruity Finds. And I also incredibly kindly got gifted a pair of loafers from Buffalo, who are a brand I've supported since I was like 15. It's honestly surreal that, hello, it's honestly surreal that they sent me these, um, but they are too big and Guys, I had an extra insole, I put on plasters, I'm wearing two pairs of thick socks and I've been walking around my apartment and they, my feet actually fall out of them. It's really annoying. So I'm gonna contact them and see if, like, they're literally unworn, so to see if they want um, me to return them to them. I don't want them to go to waste because of the shoe scenario not working and it just changed everything. So I'm now kind of changing up the vibe. I think I'm gonna wear this yellow page top under. So I'm really feeling all of these khaki autumnal colour palettes. She's a winner. I wish the skirt was like a little bit low waisted. This coat is incred. I even think, <laughs> incred. I think even open, like with everything hanging down and you can like see the stripe and the zip. I think this is kind of fun, you know? Do I wear this hat? I feel like she's always a winner. You know what, I'm gonna wear the hat. I'm gonna wear the hat. I feel like I can squish it in my pocket. Yeah. Okay, this is my outfit. I don't have anything else to say. Today's Friday and I'm shooting with Don't Shop Swap, who are one of my favourite sustainable platforms. I did a whole video about them actually, I'm going to link it on the screen. And you can basically swap clothes in your wardrobe and that gets converted into coins you can spend on other pieces other people have swapped. This is what I'm wearing for the day. I'm going to be going out with the girls from The Shoe and my friend Paige, aka Yellow Paige, the brand, um, in Hackney. There's something going on tonight. I'm wearing my favourite top by Gigi. This has become like a basic for me and I've just layered it with another tank top. I've tied these ribbons on the straps which I did in a previous outfit of the week. I think I've done them too tight, like I hate hate the dimensions of that. I've got my favourite necklace. This is literally like my staple when, my go-to staple when I have no idea what to wear. Crystal Rocks, Messy Mind Store and Pilgrim Jewellery. This little wrap is from My Mum Made It. I'm wearing it backwards and I'm wearing my favourite jeans from Menace Vintage. These are my favourite and I'm wearing my Carvella boots because they want me to bring black boots for the shoe. I've also in here this bowling bag that's vintage, the brand of Sugar Thrills, and I got it at the Peach Shen sample sale. I've got in my boxing boots, you know the ones, because they want me to bring those as well. So I'm planning on leaving this at their studio or Paige's studio if I'm actually gonna go clubbing because I'm obviously not gonna bring a bag. I just know I'm gonna be cold, but I'm just gonna have to brave it. I'm wearing this jacket. This is from Portobello Vintage Market. It's my favorite and it's got a double zip. Literally obsessed. I think it also goes so well with this colour palette. I was going to do no bag for the evening, but I think I've just got too much stuff. Um, so I'm going to bring this one. I'm not obsessed with the way that it looks. I really wanted... Ugh, I hate that. Like, why are you here? I would love one that's a little bit more subtle, but I just do not have a crossbody that really suits. So we've gone for this one. It's Pasha. Um, it's from Vinted. And I'm going to bring my yellow page beanie. Oh yeah, the weird thing is of me wearing these boots is I never wear boots with baggy low waisted jeans and I think it just like looks weird like I just look it just is a very bizarre choice but this is the look let's ignore the shoes like the shoes are not part of it they can go away got my rings everything's good uh, right should we do some solo <laughs> I'm never shooting again <laughs> <laughs> Oh wait, I- Cute as fuck. Like that. 
I have got the vlog. 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 I have to get a future Love Island person and then people will go back and be like, how, how are you friends with Hi, I'm Elliot. Hi, I'm Elliot. <laughs> I'm Elliot, I'm a scaffolder from London. I'm a scaffolder, just no. a labourer, I'm not a scaffolder, no, no, alright. <laughs> but I've got my own belt, yeah, and I've got a spanner and a spirit level, yeah, to make sure she's bubble, yeah. Dishy and you it's saturday and i'm going to wings vintage i've never been to them they kind of blew up on tiktok they're like a big warehouse sale at color factory in london and i actually ran into the girl who runs it at an event last week is that you or is that a ghost oh what is you what are you trying to do what do you want my husband is so annoying we ran, we ran into the girl at an event last week and she very kindly like invited us down um so yeah, we're gonna go check it out and see what's up. I'm wearing this Lacoste jumper. I'm literally just wearing clothes that I bought in second year of uni and it's kind of spinning me out. You know when you wear clothes that remind you of years ago and you're kind of like, this is kind of weird. But anyway, I haven't worn this jumper in ages. It's from Depop. I'm wearing my serotonin vintage baby tee, one of my fave baby tees under. I'm wearing my cleanse um, to keep warm and I've got on these jeans, which, oh, I don't think any of you well, maybe some of you will actually remember these. I used to wear these quite a lot. The Hysteric Glamour that I got from Depop for 20 quid. And Hysteric Glamour are so expensive. And I think if these were on Depop now, they would be like £150 at least. And the fact that I managed to get them for 20 quid, I'm like, what? Anyway, I'm wearing my Paul Frank bag. Again, I haven't worn this in a really long time. Just a good side bag. You can fit a lot in there. And then I kind of think, you know what? Like, we might as well wear my Paul Frank beanie also from Depop. I look kind of like... it's. I think because these jeans are very like 70s, kind of like a tight flare, kind of like a loose flare. Oh my god, they're a bit intense on the bum. Don't know if I like this outfit. I changed again for like the millionth time. I think I'm gonna stick with this. Um, this jacket underneath is one of my faves. It's actually originally from River Island and I found that charity shop. And I'm gonna do a TikTok on all my favorite River Island things I found secondhand because I've got so many and I think it just proves of how good their design team must have been like mid to early 2000s or whatever because it's so good. I've put on my gray jeans. It's a little bit matchy matchy, which I don't know if I'm in the mood for. Tempted to wear my new shoes because I've only worn them once and they really rubbed on the side of my feet. I think that's because I just new shoes and I need to get used to them and I have very bony feet. Yeah, I love these. They're from Adidas and they're the Circo Loco collab. They're on my LA haul, which I'll link on the screen. And I'm wearing this beanie that I got from Vinted. It'll be in my Vinted haul, which will probably be up by the time this video is up. Honestly, I've been obsessed with Vinted. I'm, I'm always obsessed with Vinted, but I feel like in the last like two months, I've been having such good luck with Vinted, so. Yeah, I'm really excited for that haul to come out as well. I'm wearing the same bag. So my stuff's in it. I can't really be bothered to change it, but I don't know if I want to change to this beanie. What do we think? Like, this is very classic me. The hat's got blue to match the bag and red to match the shoes, so I'm like, oh, do I just wear this? It's Sunday. I don't... Fully know how I feel about my outfit. I'm experimenting. Um, yeah, the moment has come where I embarrass myself on the internet because I think I have toothpaste on my mouth. Ugh, I'm literally so icked. Let's just ignore that. I think you slightly see it throughout this brief day clip or whatever, but I promise, like, I get rid of it. I was incredibly inspired by Lucy McFadden and she wore these bows in white, I think it was, the other day. And I'm obsessed with it. And you all know I love a little ribbon moment. 
Um, so I found these off of eBay. I'll actually link them down below. I was playing around with the placement and I don't really know if this is like a weird place to put them. But nothing was really working apart from this. So I've stuck with this for now. This trench coat is from Finds Well that I got the other day. Um, I got two things from their pop-up that they kindly let me pick out. This jacket is huge. It's an XL. And hold on. Okay, I haven't even told you what I'm doing today. Today is Sunday, which means it's a market day and I'm gonna go to Portobello Market with Yasmin. I've never been there on a Sunday, so I can imagine it's gonna be really, really busy. And the other day when I was at the finds thing, I was with my friend Bibi, Bibi Button, and she showed me a trick with oversized trench coats where you can take the strap and just tie a bow at the back and it immediately helps cinch everything in. And I've never thought about doing that. I really cannot decide if I love this outfit or hate it the zip up is from depot these trousers are my nippy studios solar cargoes ew get away from the camera with your <laughs> and i don't wear them enough like i really don't so i want to wear them and i feel like they're a good sunday outfit and then these are my um adidas guys the same girl that I got mine from, and Yasmin was like, I want ones like you, and we literally, first thing we found. I think it's a match, guys. I'm, I'm actually jealous, I like them more than mine, I think. Oh, no, I like it. Is it really? Oh God, I look like a freak. Oh, should I get it? Yeah. <laughs> All of these bitches here with their furry hats, like, <laughs> bitches with blue eyes be like, <laughs> Vlog! Hey! Hey! hey. 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 It's called harmonizing, you wouldn't get it. You're gonna get demonetized from that. <laughs> Going to Thank you. She's back! I'm back, baby, like I've never met. Today we're having a shopping experience, come with me. Okay. So, see these little vintage cuteness. Mm -hmm. Look at this iconic tea. Mm -hmm. My life is a flop era. No, it's not. It is. I tried to buy a necklace, she told me it was too much. Yeah, come here. This, this bitch. Insert pictures of Abby being Abby. <laughs> Say, my necklace was too much. I bought it. <laughs> did you? Yeah, I did. Yes, shut up. <laughs> Is you the stop <laughs> My camera's gonna die, but I'm running out to run some errands. I'm wearing this top, which is actually a vintage Madonna like album release tee that was my mum's. And then these amazing new baggy trousers. Um, I got them from Menace Vintage at Portobello Market. They were literally the pair that Yasmin held up. Um, she was gonna buy them, but they didn't fit her right, so I stole them. I got them. <laughs> and I'm wearing also new boots I got the other day from charity shop. They're from North Face and they're fluffy and they're like suede and I'm obsessed with them. It's so cold outside, like it's proper winter, so I'm gonna wear this souvenir hoodie and I'm gonna wear my fave as it's my warmest jacket. I really don't know if this is anybody else, but I go in phases of wanting to wear headphones and wanting to wear um, earphones. And right now I'm gonna headphone phase, I mean I say that. Today is the first day of this phase. I'm also going home later to go and see my family, which I can't wait. And I really, really hope my cat's there. Anyone else have an adventurous cat and you have no idea if they're gonna be home or not? My cat literally could go away for like a week. You know, it doesn't really tell you about these plans. You just sort of have to, uh, fingers crossed that he'll be home when you visit. Anyway, I got these new gloves the other day from Tiger and they're touch green and I'm really into this colorway. Academic potential. Christmas Avenue's be. Ding, Ding dong! dong.